Seriously, if you do know a pal that goes to Napier, try and find out if this is true, because I heard a wee rumour, and I want to know if it's fact, right? I heard, if you go to Napier for long enough, eventually, you'll steal your own wallet back. <laughs> So, someone please fi find out if that's true, that, that'd be absolutely awesome. Uh, before we get started, I'm going to do a wee, bit of, uh, a wee bit of topical material. I'd like to read what's been going on in the papers. And according to the record, uh, all men should be worried because gay rape is on the increase. I'm not worried because I'm not gay. <laughs> See how that works. Um, but also, ask the doc. This is brilliant. Write in your questions to the doctor. And there's a woman here who's been having a wee bit of trouble with her weight throughout life and she says, Dear Craig Lennox, our GP, my one wish is to be thin before I die. Now my advice would be try AIDS. <laughs> it's got a good success rate. Now the more observant among you will have noticed I'm not the most politically correct person in the world. And I think I can stem this back to my nursery teacher, right? Because this is a wee example. He came in one day and he went like that. All right, class, we can no longer sing Baba Black Sheep because it's not perfectly correct. So instead, we'll be having a wee game of Good Whispers. <laughs> That's where it stems from. We can all get it back. But school was fun. And uh, do you remember getting all these wee sayings you get taught throughout school, like, you know, to help guide you through life? Like, it's not the winning, it's the taking part that counts. Now, history boy here will back me up when I say, fuck the Swiss, at least the Nazis got into the spirit of things. <laughs> and another wee saying that was used to go was, treat others the same way you'd like to be treated yourself. Don't know about you, but maybe that explains why gay rape's on the increase in this country. 